Hello, welcome to my second video where I try out this uh, game of Choker and you can download the app now in the description of the link below and very exciting game it's a mix of poker and chess first of all you start off a bit of poker then you move on to the chess I've had a lot of fun uh, playing this game and trying it out and in this video uh, I'm playing against the legendary Anna Chess Anna Rudolph of course doesn't need an introduction and uh, we met up in London um, at the Bloomsbury Hotel and we tried out this game and it was recorded and it's a bit of fun I know a lot of you guys out there you only like my blitz videos but it's nice to try different things out and this choker game is is just a really nice refreshing thing that you guys might like to give a go so here's my video on me playing against Anna and who do you think is going to win and uh, it's a lot of fun uh, so I hope you enjoyed the video light-hearted we're very good friends so if there's any banter I hope it doesn't come across as me being rude <laughs> so enjoy good luck Simon you will need it Anna I crushed you in the last one the rematch is on 2-0 is coming up now so okay let's go so I feel again I have great cards like I did last time are you going to learn your lesson and fold or are you going to um, try to be brave again and make a very bad mistake let's see let's see what you do in the previous game, you had really good cards, and I should have realized that. But this time, I think you're bluffing. So you're going to make the same mistake. That's no. what you're saying. So, <laughs> I'm calling so you're, bluff. You're, you're, you're repeating the mistake twice. OK, well, that's good to know. It's good to know you're, you learn lessons of life, you know? So, <laughs> OK, and you're checking straight away. That's a sign of strength. So you're saying, oh, no, I've got such great heart. cards. Check, check, check. OK. I'm checking as well. Oh, <laughs> so, look at yeah. you. Yeah, I'm so giving, brave. I'm giving a little check. Okay, hmm. over to you. So I'm scared well. because I've got absolutely nothing. <laughs> and, or do I? All in. <laughs> so again? Put that in your pipe and smoke it. Um, so again, yeah, well, actually, am I bluffing? Am I double bluffing? You're not a poker player, you have to realize. If, you, if you're going to fold now, you've lost half your chips for nothing. So obviously you're not, because you're Anna. <laughs> oh. I'm calling your bluff, Simon. Okay. So what do you think I have? I, I reckon you have no queen. I reckon you have no queen. Don't but you, need, you neither. How much would you like to bet that I have no queen? Well, an entire bar of chocolate. Done. That's a lot. <laughs> Done. Okay. So, I have a lot of pawns, it seems. Mm-hmm. Okay. I also have a pawn. So, it's my move first. And obviously, Anna's going super, super defensive. And I will as well, because I have lots you of You have pawns. a second pawn. I know, Amazing. I have, I have a second pawn. Yeah, it's not looking good at the moment, I have to say. It's not looking good at the moment. Okay, you have a bishop. Now, I have a knight. And I don't think the knights are particularly the best pieces in this game. So I'm doing well so far. Okay. You're doing great, Simon, indeed. So you have three cards to lay. And you have a knight, so it's pretty even. It's pretty even. Now I have... I should have thought about this before I laid the last one. <laughs> <laughs> you know, foresight is a, good, is a good thing. It is. I have one more piece left. This is quite even at the moment. If you lay a pawn now, it's totally even. Do you have better than a pawn? A knight? You have a queen, don't you? Do you have a queen? Mm. What do you think? Well, in the first game, you did. Look, this at the way time... you, look at the way you play so passively. All these pieces hogging around. Okay, yes, I Bing. do. There we go. In with the queen. Not again. <laughs> this is so unfair, but you know what? At least I have something to compensate for that queen. Okay. And that's a rook. Okay, okay. So this is kind of like better for me i think I, I i think i have more pieces you're attacking my queen so i'm going to come in we have the time limit going on mm -hmm. and if we count the points again it does seem fairly even but i, I have the edge you have an edge that's true but so it's did not I bluff too you bad. again did i bluff you again i think so you bluffed but not too much did my fighting talk win again i think it did <laughs> 
I'm not sure what's the best strategy here with my minor pieces. So I have Just a rook. Resign. No way. Keep it, keep it quick. <laughs> keep it quick and easy. A rook okay. and a minor piece for the queen. But you also have a pawn. This past pawn is annoying. I think you're in trouble. I Am think I you're in, in trouble? trouble? Not yet. I don't believe you. Okay, we'll see. So, mm -hmm. again, I, another thing I like about this game is the way you can put the pieces. I always try to keep them quite aggressive, and Anna goes for a super solid defense. You know, solid, solid all the way. Is that fair to say, or is that? It is fair to say. I think it reflects our personalities too. I go for the. Would you same. say you're super solid? I am. I'm very Would you say solid. I'm super unsolid? I don't, yes. know, I don't know what the opposite is. You're very unsolid. <laughs> very unsolid, okay. Okay, so. I'm going to give you a check to scare you. Is there a word for that? I'm sure there is. <laughs> what, what is super unsolid? Soft. Soft? Yeah, it is. Liquid. <laughs> liquid, yeah. Right. You're liquid, <laughs> Simon. I, I'm liquid. <laughs> so, Where are you going? You oh, no, give I've, me a lost, check? I've lost the pawn. Ah. Oh, no. Of course. Oh, no. Check on g7, wants to trick oh, yeah, me. The trickster, trickster all the way. And he's threatening that move because my knight on d7 will be hanging. So this is getting really tough. I cannot move the knight from d7 because it's mate on e7. Uh-oh. Basically, you're in trouble. I think what we've come to understand is that this game was made for me. <laughs> I am clearly the best in the world. I beat everyone. Doesn't matter who I come up against. Fellow brilliant gingers, best commentators in the world. I'm still the best. So thank you. Cheers, Anna. Your move. I'm not <laughs> <Sure>. done. <laughs> okay, sorry. <laughs> We're coming with a check then. But that was a nice speech, Simon. Thank you. Thank it's you. good that you said it before you won the game, so now. Thank you, I, I, I enjoyed it. So. Hmm. That's a good move. Now you have 60 seconds left. <sighs> and a very difficult position, not looking great. It's not, it's not looking that good. No. no, but I'm not giving up. No. So I think the chess part is probably more important than the poker part, but actually, as we've seen, the poker part is incredibly important because if you go into the game and the, the two times I've played you, I've had the material advantage mm -hmm. and that has proven to be very, very important. So, okay, let's get another queen, I think. Is that okay with you? If I get one more queen? It's not really okay with me. At the moment I'm controlling the h7 square, but my king is also really weak and my minor pieces are not coordinating very well. So it's looking troublesome. It's looking a little bit tricky. Oh, that was a really bad move. <laughs> I may as well just resign actually, but you can make your move. Yes, I'm losing another piece. I think regardless of my blunder at the very end, the position was lost for black. I think... You were right that the great, this game and the previous one proved that the chess phase is important and getting lucky with the card. So uh, I don't well, think well, it well, proves well, that you I, are the I best ginger. It proves. Can, hang, hang on a minute. <laughs> when you say lucky with a card, that's what every bad poker player says. I'm unlucky with the cards. I never played poker before, so no, I'm... <laughs> no, I was really very like lucky choker. with the cards. I was very lucky with the cards. You're right. So. Usually it doesn't happen to me with the matches that I... I I get not really good cards in both games. So in the previous matches I played on my channel against my friends, it was either like you got lucky in one game and the other one, your pieces are you can't fold. quite weak. You can't fold. Well, that's you can't the one fold. thing I should learn, I think, yeah. because since I don't have poker experience, yeah. I can't really read you and I don't know when you are going all in or when you bet a lot. Is this a Well, Anna, if it helps you, I can't read myself either. <laughs> okay. Even, even when I say something, I'm not even sure if I'm telling the truth or not. <laughs> so that might make you feel a bit more easy. Uh, sleep a little bit better after you lost 2-0 there. Uh, but g generally, lovely game to play. Loads of fun. Choker. And you can download it from the App Store. Um, we're having loads of fun playing it today. And has played it on our streams. I'm going to stream uh, on my channel as well. And it does seem to combine the aspects of poker and chess in a great way. Uh, so give it a go. Download it from the App Store. And uh, yeah, I'm just the best. I'm lucky. Thank you. <laughs> Goodbye. I'm not late yet. Done. 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 Sorry, over to you, Anna. I'll let you have one more. Congratulations for Thank today, you, Simon. I'm going to challenge you in the future on okay. my channel. Okay. <laughs> Cheers. Thank you. Perfect.